Hey guys I am Nikaisha from Canadian Immigration TV. In this video I'm going to talk about Measures announces by IRCC to reduce process time for immigration. If you're interested in learning more about this topic, please watch this video all the way to the end. For the most recent immigration news and updates, please like and share to this video don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel and hit the subscribe button icon of the notification bell. Let's get started with the video. Over 500,000 permanent residency applications were decided by Immigration, Refugees and Citizenship Canada IRCC, in 2021. Fraser revealed that in the first quarter of 2022, Canada plans to make 147,000 permanent residency final decisions more than double the number from the same period in 2021. In February 2022, Canada will launch a new permanent residence application tracker for spouses and dependents, allowing applicants to check the status of their applications online. Internal IRCC documents have revealed that the department's actual projected processing times for economic immigration programs are significantly longer than what is stated on the government website in recent weeks. In the coming months, Canada will update the online processing times tool to provide IRCC clients with more up-to-date estimates of how long it will take to process applications, according to Fraser. According to a memo dated November 24, IRCC expected application processing for the Foreign Skilled Worker Program, FSWP, to take 20 months, far longer than the six-month threshold for express entry managed programs. The same document stated that processing for Canadian Experience Class CEC, candidates would take roughly eight months. The document further stated that during the first half of 2022, express entry drawings would not invite FSWP and CEC candidates. Fraser could not say when the draws would restart, but he did say that the measures put in place today were meant to speed up immigration processes. He claims that putting these drawings on hold while the express entry inventory is processed will allow IRCC to eventually hold draws without adding to the backlog. More than 1.8 million people are now waiting decision from Immigration Canada. Citizenship applications, temporary foreign employees, families, students, refugees and visitors all fall under this category. As of December 2021, the express entry backlog totaled at 119,000 applicants. For express entry candidates in Canada who may be forced to abandon their positions or leave the country as IRCC delays draws for some candidates, Fraser said they are looking into options to keep employees in the country, but no ideal solution has yet been found. 